Hi everyone, welcome back to Be Rich. Today I'm going to talk about Tata Motors, Tata Motors DVR. And if you should be buying the share, by the end of that, I will tell you if you should be buying Tata Motors or not. So, the news on Tata Motors is supposed to be fabulous and it is fabulous. And yes, in this channel, we do tend to enjoy Tata Motors and Tata, anything related to Tata, we all seem very happy in this channel. That's true. As value investors, they keep unlocking value for us constantly. So, we're ever so grateful to the Tata family for giving us investors, especially small investors, opportunities quite a few times to enjoy some of the food on their table. They're a very large company and they're a very old family and they're very kind to investors who believe in them, who are willing to join them in their journey. So for that loan reason, that's the main reason we celebrate Tata so much in our uh, channels. And the other reason is, of course, we have a long shared history with the Tata group because my father worked for them. And uh, that shared history is something we are very fond of. So these are the main reasons we go on harping about Tata. So that said, does it warrant this kind of celebration is a question which is valid. You can ask this question. Do you guys should be celebrating this Tata Tata so much? Do you know they made mistakes too? Yes, Tatas have made mistakes. They made many mistakes and I'm sure they will make plenty of mistakes in the future. And there's a lot of questions also asked by you guys. This is all under the helm of Mr. Ratan Tata. If Mr. Ratan Tata leaves, like all of us will leave this world one day, what will happen to the Tata group? I do believe the family which has survived over 150 years will continue to survive at least in my lifetime. Current young leadership which is under him seem to be very capable of doing this and they seem very proactive in believing in the Tata philosophy and continuing their philosophy and Chandar who is running it right now is also doing a fabulous job. That being said, the Tata Motors has become uh, tops uh, market capitalization overtaken Maruti for the first time in seven years which is great news. Yes, there are people who are critics of Tata Motors uh, vehicles. I do hear them. A lot of you have reached out to me on Instagram saying Tata Motor vehicle finish is not as great as uh, Maruti's. Maruti's finish of their vehicles and the interiors and the cars overall look and feel and ride is far superior to the Tata Motors offerings that may be. And uh, I'm not here to get into that discussion. It is a personal opinion and it's a valid opinion for those of you who do have it. But I must give Tata Motors credit that they have improved vastly from the early days of Indigo and the Indica to where they are right now. There's a vast ocean of difference from the product offering they're offering. And the finish and the service, everything has improved. And it seems to be heading in the right direction. That is why the market has rewarded them and continues to reward them. And their bold vision in electric vehicles and take, trying to take the lead in that is also fantastic. So as an investor, it is heartwarming to see this, that the company is taking risks and moving forward and trying to make strategic moves, playing for the next 10 years, 15 years ahead. And EV vehicles is the future as far as we know today. Yes, there are other technologies available like hydrogen. There are other technologies which you can talk about. But as of now, this is where the market is. So looking at that, they seem to be making the right moves and I'm very appreciative that of that as an investor. The, the main reason for the share price to recently rally so much is that there has been growth, revenue has gone up, operation efficiency has gone up and their sub brand which is Jaguar and Land Rover which is owned by Tata is also doing very well. That being said, there's another reason why the shares have risen is they have received a no objection certificate from the BSE, from the stock exchange for cancellation of the DVR and conversion to an ordinary share. That has pushed Tata Motors shares by another 3%. Right. So the conversion ratio right now is 7 ordinary shares for every 10 DVR shares. So if you have 10 DVR shares, those will be extinguished and destroyed and in its place you will get 7 regular ordinary Tata Motors shares. That is the conversion ratio which is there. So this is aims to be completed by this in six months from uh, 21st of December. So that means by June sometime is when it's expected to be completed. This has pushed up Tata Motors shares and has pushed up Tata DVR shares. So DVR shares currently trading at 587. Tata Motors is trading at 879 right now. All right. So you can do the simple math calculation, see where's the margin ratio for you for in terms of profit. 10 DVR shares goes to 7 Tata Motors shares. Do some simple arithmetics and you can see at which price point it makes sense buying it. But do remember, 
we are a value investor channel so we do tend to buy and hold on to these shares for a very long time i have been buying tata motors dvr way way back from 2000 or even older and i've been buying tata motors dvr at prices of 34 believe it or not that time un's logic to buying me buying the tata motors dvr is you said you enjoy the same uh, privileges of owning the tata motors uh, share only thing you don't have the voting rights as the you know, regular share has which was true so in terms of dividend and everything and he uh, told me back then itself in some day this dvr will be converted to regular shares he says that time also you'll enjoy it it'll become a regular share so if i believed him back then which i did i bought a lot of tata motor dvrs and those DVRs will all now get converted into Tata Motor shares. So this is the reason why we play for the long haul. We play for the long game. When you know that, especially when it comes to Tata's, you can play for the long game and you can sit and wait. So if you don't see an opportunity now, if it's become as Anand says a diamond needle, please wait. Opportunities will come when markets do correct, markets do move. Like the pandemic crash happened or during the Mumbai attacks, the crash happened. At that time, you can move in and buy some of these shares you've been looking at in the Tata group for some time at a very low cost. So keep a uh, chin up and you will be able to pick these shares up. And I've given you the advice as far as the DVR is concerned. Do the math and see. And if it makes sense for you in your arithmetics, then put a target price which you're looking at the, the DVR based on your maths. And then you can look at picking up the Tata DVRs. Thank you for watching this program today. And I'll see you in the next one soon. Bye. Good evening. My team has decided to do another event. The last event was at Trivandrum was a very successful one. So we decided to ask people where we wanted to do an event. And my team chose to do an event in Dubai. We are planning to do an event in Dubai on the 24th of February. The event is roughly scheduled between 3.30 to 5.30. It's a Saturday. You'll have plenty of time. Those desirous of attending the event or meeting me may contact my team at the WhatsApp number given below or drop an email at the email ID given. My team will contact you and help you. I hope to meet you all in Dubai. It's not only Dubai, anywhere from the Emirates. I hope to see you there. Thank you. It's a great privilege and honor that so many of you in thousands have subscribed to my channel and have supported me. I have written two books in English, The Alchemy of Money, and Ordinary Stocks, Extraordinary Profits. These books are published by us and are ready. If you want to procure a copy, send us a message to the WhatsApp number given below and my team would respond to you. If you want an Amazon Kindle copy, you can click the link below. Finally, those who wish to consult with me can send a mail to berichenglish at gmail.com. Once again, I thank you for your support. If you like this video, press the subscribe button of my channel, hit the like button and turn on the bell notification.